Hey, what up y'all? Mr. Cruz here, the hardest worker in the room, back with another BandLab tutorial. And in today's video, if you have ever worked in BandLab or tried to do something in BandLab and you end up getting scratchy, staticky sounds when you're trying to listen to something back that you created, this is the video for you to watch. So what you're experiencing in those moments is something called latency. Now in audio terms, latency just means that there's a delay or there's a lag between when you say something or when you press play and then you actually hear the music. Um, so latency happens and it's a super duper simple issue. It has, it's like a super fancy, you know, technical thing that has to do with like audio drivers and, you know, bit depths and all that stuff. Simple thing is here is what I'm going to show you how to do that or how to fix that if you're working on a, um, a laptop or on a computer or desktop. So what you want to do is you have to find the settings for whatever audio driver that you are using. Me, I'm running my music through um, a recording uh, or audio interface and to look, I actually have to do this on a separate screen, but actually no, we can type it in here. So I'm going to type in, it's a focus, right? Bam, focus right device. So that's what it is. It's a Scarlet 2i2 um, audio interface. So I'm gonna go into the settings of that device. Make sure that it pops up. Boom, there it is. All right, so the issue that you're having is that your buffer size is set too high. So if you're not using this kind of audio device, um, whatever internal device that your computer has, you're just going to go in there, find the settings, and you're going to lower your buffer size. I have never really ever gone lower than 256. A little notification will pop up. I'm going to have to refresh my session. And now when we listen back to it, Boom, super simple, super easy. Just find the audio device, go into the settings and lower your buffer size to 256. Should work perfectly. That's what I got for you guys. Hopefully it's helpful, hopefully it's useful. Let me know in the comments below any other tutorials you wanna see in the future. It's your boy, Mr. Cruz, out.